Hi, and welcome to Getting Started with Custom Investments video. I'm Katherine Ellis, a Product Manager with Clarity PPM. An organization's strategy reflects the reality of its environment. Hence, leaders typically give a lot of time and thought to decide the strategy for the organization that will drive the business forward. As leaders, you want to articulate your corporate strategy, objectives, and investment plans in your organization's preferred language and not be limited by options offered by a tool. That's what precisely the custom investments capability in Clarity PPM is designed to help you do. Because you want to define an overarching strategy, you can ask your administrator to create a new custom investment in Clarity named Strategy Investment. Also ask your administrator to create two custom fields, Outcome Expected and Strategy Scope. These fields will help you and your teams explain details associated with the strategy. When your administrator creates a custom investment, Clarity PPM automatically creates a standard blueprint you can create a copy of this blueprint and modify it so stakeholders can access details that reflect their business goals and objectives. Let's now open the strategy investment. You can see a few default fields that are added to the grid. Let's add the outcomes expected and strategy fields to the grid. We can now start entering the key strategies for an organization here. After you enter the strategies, save your view so that other stakeholders can use it to review the investment. You can provide more details associated with the strategy so that you can collaborate successfully with stakeholders. Let's provide some key links that explain the business value of this objective and provide examples of how competitors are approaching the market. Adding a resource, such as a business analyst, to work on the strategy will help to populate some critical objectives associated with the strategy. Let's assign a couple of tasks to the business analysts so they know what is expected of them and the time frame in which they need to deliver results. Did you notice that you can view the tasks in multiple layouts? Each layout has its own advantages and you can learn more about them in the Clarity PPM documentation. The business analyst can go ahead and team up with various stakeholders and add financial details such as the estimated cost to implement this strategy. The business analyst can also use timesheets in Clarity PPM to record their time and utilization. Let's quickly review the four key strategies that have been identified for the organization. All four strategies now have specific managers and have resources working on identifying key objectives and financial details. You have now seen how you can use custom investments to drive strategy for your organization. Let's look at another example of custom investments where the business analysts have broken the strategy down into objectives and key results. This custom investment has all the details you need to know about critical objectives associated with the key strategies decided by the organization. Let's use the group buy option to review the objectives associated with each strategy and the total money that is needed to implement the strategy. In this case, the business analysts have treated each objective as a separate investment item. Hence, you can see a more granular breakdown of how to implement each strategy. 
I am sure you now understand how you can use custom investments to create and track various activities in your organization that cannot be categorized as projects but still need to be managed and budgeted so they can be completed successfully. Thank you for watching this video on getting started with custom investments. In the next video, I will help you understand how you can present and validate your business strategy to your executive team by using roadmaps in Clarity PPM. For more detailed information about this product, click the information bubble in the top right corner to load the product page.